Welcome everybody to Carol's Art Room. In today's video, I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to do a bloom. I'm doing a messy bloom. I haven't done one before. Um, so you just pour your paint in layers, any messy direction you want to put them in and uh, see how it comes out. And uh, I think it'll be good. So I'm going to give it a try. So stay tuned. Hi, everybody. Okay, I was trying something new today, but it didn't seem to work out. So now I'm going to try um, a bloom, a messy bloom. With because uh, I've got some paints that I've mixed up with it, with some different um, ingredients. So I want to try it before I mix it with other colors. Let's change my gloves. Now my hand's all sweaty and the glove won't go on. Oh. oh, I should have waited. Okay. I'll let my hands dry up first. Okay. So I've got... Let me just have a little sip of my cold coffee. I've got silver. Which is Masters, a uh, Modern Masters. It's a uh, metallic paint that I bought at Michael's, something different. This is opaque, so I'm going to put it down first. I'm just going to do random squigglies. And I want to use black cell activator, so... <clears throat> lighter color to add to it so I do have some uh, twinkle I think this is okay so now I'm gonna put down this is a Grumbacher dioxazin purple Twinkle next. And then I have another uh, pigment, which is a Perlex magenta. seemed a bit thick so I just add a little bit of water
That was a um, Pearlex magenta. So I've done the purple, the gray, that one. Now I just have this one left, which is PBO um, Blue Violet, I think it's called. Violet Blue. So debating whether to put some green in. I think I'll put a little bit of green in. This is very thick. Put this PBO blue violet. Oh, now I think I did. I why did I put that green in there? But you never know. If I've ever done one a messy one before. Okay, so now I'm going to use black cell activator, and I think I might use my mini blower. Take out some air bubbles. Okay, let's see what I can get. Oh, that's pretty. Hmm. I think I had a lot of cell activator down. Probably a too much, but it's very pretty. Well, I know that my pouring medium works anyway, so that's good. It's very cool when you do the messy. You get so many different colors around. I like it. I didn't 
come out very good there. Give it a spin. Go for the spin. So we get it in the center. try that and it never works for me trying to get some more cells in the middle but so colorful.
haven't tried the spin spin swipe yet. Am I gonna give that a whirl? That's pretty good now. We mind coming this way a little more. That side's gorgeous. is I got some white paint from underneath coming through it's okay Probably spun it enough. I always say that and then I do one more. So I think it's good. I think it's good. I like the way the gray's coming through the silver. It's gonna sh it's gonna be shiny. I know it. I'll hold it up for you for a close up. Here, I hope you like this one. I like it. I like the messy bloom. I like how the colors are. Scattered everywhere. It's really nice. Okay, thanks for watching and have a great day, everybody. And come back to Carol's Art Room. Please subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications and then you'll get notified when I do a new, new video. The dried result will be at the end. Bye-bye. Hi, everyone. This is my dried messy bloom. pretty that is. Look at that blue pigment shining through there. And the Pearl X. I can see if you can see it. It's pretty down there. Anyway, I like it. Turned out awesome. Thanks for watching.